Hi guys, this is Step Up. So I just wanted to come to you quickly so that I could talk about a quick like prophetic insight that I had while I was dreaming and an angel of the Lord came to me to tell me and give me this message and it's not just for me, it's for everybody watching, waiting on our departure and the rapture of the church and it's about the doomsday clock. So first off, I've seen the doomsday clock and it was like at 90 seconds. And in 20, like this year, 2023, they moved the doomsday clock. As you can see up here, they moved it to 90 seconds before midnight. And then they're saying this is the closest humanity has ever been to Armageddon. But the angel of the Lord actually told me, and then I seen the clock move and it moved to five seconds before midnight. And he said, with an authoritative voice, he says, it's not 90 seconds to midnight. In fact, they have it wrong. It is exactly five seconds to midnight. And I woke up from that dream. And I knew the Lord was giving this warning because basically it's saying this can go down anytime, anytime. And there's no steps in between it's just like this is the next step to take and when we think about it five is the number of grace it represents grace it represents that the age of grace and the holy spirit and we know these things will be taken and end um as the restrainer taken from the earth at the time at the end of the age of grace um you know introducing the time of jacob's trouble and so this is also what the five mm -hmm. seconds to midnight represents. So that's also important to realize that goes with this message. So this is me being faithful, sharing it with you guys so that you guys are on the same page with God and his Holy Spirit understanding. And you can take this to the Lord to pray on it for confirmation. But this is the message that needs to be going out and any time now, any time now, the next step is like sudden destruction and our departure with it. So I just want to bring that to you also for encouragement, because this is what we're waiting on, right? This is our blessed hope. And this is why Jesus commands us to watch. And this is our greatest hope. So we're just calling out to the Lord. Come quickly, Jesus, come quickly. Baruch haba Bashem Adonai. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. And I encourage you, if there's um, any sins that are you're struggling with, we all have those. Just take it to the Lord. Pray on it. Pray for forgiveness. Pray for deliverance. And the Lord knows your heart. And he knows you're trying your best. And he knows what that looks like. So again, we are to repent in order for our sins to be covered. Okay. So I just encourage you to do that as well in preparation to keep our garments clean, to be found worthy to stand before the Son of Man. So in Jesus' name, I pray that so, and may the peace of Christ that surpasses all understanding be with you and all of your own in these last days. Amen.